Finally, IPv6 configuration, let's have a look how to do this. You probably want to find out how do I configure an IPv6 address. There are different options, like in IPv4, we have the static configuration, which means you will set this IPv6 address, network, and the next hop statically in your configuration. This is fine. Then we have a new part it is called stateless address auto configuration, slack. And we have DHCP like before, but in this case we have DHCP version 6. Let's have a close look and start with a static configuration with a comparison. I have included a couple of platforms. Cisco IOS IPv4 configuration compared to the IPv6 configuration. As you can see, you can enter the VLAN interface, you set the IPv4 address and the netmask. In an IPv6, because we don't have any netmask anymore, you just enter the interface the same and you set the IPv6 address with the address and the slash notation of the prefix length. With HPA series that's using Comware, it's about the same. HP Procurve, it's the same. Juniper Junos, it's also the same. The only difference is you don't set the address under the family inet, but you set it under the family inet 6. But it's really easy. Try it out.